Hello, all of my beautiful people. Thank you so much for coming back to my channel. And it is Motivation Monday, so get ready for some motivation. So today's word comes from the quote by a band called Paramore. And it really, really just touched me and just really, really, um, I mean, it's just a great way to say this. So the quote is, keep your feet on the ground while your head is in the clouds. So what does this mean? So I come across, of course, being in the fitness industry, there are so many cocky people, so many just people who are obsessed with themselves. I mean, it's a self sport. You're constantly looking at yourself constantly. You literally diet down to be compared to other people who are dieting down. I mean, it's very, very self-centered sport. And then there's the other side of people who are just I'm humble. I'm so humble. I look great, but I'm humble. Um, always stay humble. Don't brag about what you've done. Just stay humble, but love yourself, but stay humble. And it's like, where's the balance? Um, you're either extremely cocky or extremely just like, oh, I'm not going to be cocky, but you know, so here, here's me. I'm right in the middle. Um, I would never say that I'm a humble person. I'm actually really um, outspoken. And I any kind of goal that I make, I'm not sitting down for it. I'm not um, sugarcoating it. I'm not downplaying it. I work hard as hell for what I do. And I'm never ever going to be like, oh, well, oh, that's okay. You know, I want, no, I'm going to be like, I fucking won, okay? I fucking killed it and I won. <laughs> I mean, that's it. That's just the way it is. And I just wanted to share my thoughts on how to stay grounded while you are so inflated in your head. Okay. So some people may think I'm a super, super cocky, um, self infatuated person, which I love myself. I absolutely love myself. Um, I would never call myself names, be down on myself. I would never be negative to myself ever. And that's just the way I am. And I it's my goal and my mission to spread the way I feel about myself to other people because it's so uncommon for people to love themselves that when they do come across someone who loves themselves, it's like, whoa, like this is way too much. Like you're way too obsessed with yourself. And it's like, okay, I can't hope that one in 100 people act like me and actually openly love themselves. Never, ever, ever be afraid to project how you feel and how, how much you love yourself. I mean, that's just the way it is. So if you know me, if you've seen me, you follow me, you know I just love yourself. <laughs> love yourself. Stop being afraid. Stop being afraid to love yourself. Say it out loud. Say it to people. Say it proud, okay? So when I say keep your feet on the ground while your heads are in the cloud, dream big, okay? Don't be afraid of your... Well, if your dreams aren't scary, then you know they're not big enough, honestly. So go big, man. Dream big big, but stay realistic, stay grounded, stay within yourself, you know, don't go crazy. So the difference between being cocky and confident. So confident, you exude it, you wear it on your face, you ever anywhere you go, you don't have to say anything, you don't ever have to do anything because you wear it, you wear it everywhere you go. Um, cockiness is really going around saying, I'm the best, I look the best, can't you tell I'm the best, you know, just spreading it out, like putting it in people's head, like, hello, I'm the best. But if you're confident, people look at you and they're just like, wow, she's the best. You know, that's the difference between that. And in the mindset, you really have to be just always, always stay grounded. I love myself. I know that I have an amazing body. I know that I worked hard for this body and I'm going to always, always work hard for this body. Um, but at the same time, I spread my self-love, I spread my happiness, I spread my motivation to other people in order for them to feel the way that I do. Um, if ever a client comes to me and say, hi, I want to look like you, I'm straight up, hello, you want to look like me? It's going to take a couple years. So, you know, you just, just start now and you'll look like me in a couple years. Um, because I'm fucking elite. Like, this body is not accidental. Okay. I worked hard for it. So, um, 
I try to spread that. So keep your feet on the ground when your heads are in the clouds. If you let yourself just float away to that crazy, crazy, um, just big goal, then you're you're gonna lose it. You're gonna lose it, and you're you're gonna lose yourself. You're gonna get way too cocky, way too just. It, it, you can see people who are really trying to get attention in real life and who need that. Um, this is a big thing. <sighs> Cocky people need that inflation from other people. They need people to tell them that they look beautiful, that they look great daily, okay? Someone who's confident already knows. Someone who actually lo truly, truly loves themselves actually already knows that they're great and knows that they work hard and knows that they'll get to their goal as long as they're, you know, they stay towards the course and keep doing what they're doing. But most of the time, cocky people actually are self-conscious deep down and they need that inflation from other people to um, validate them. So you don't want to, you don't ever, ever want to place your um your happiness never put your happiness in someone else's hands never depend on someone else for happiness never depend on someone else for your progress like everything has to be within yourself every single thing like you when you wake up in the morning you should be able to say today's gonna be a great day you shouldn't look next to you at your partner or go online and like try to look at someone else you should never look at anyone else to see am i gonna have a good day today like are you gonna make my day good today like absolutely not this is you, this is your life, and you need to make yourself happy. You, 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 you. And I'm gonna teach you that, guys, like every single Monday, every single every single week, all over my Instagram, everywhere I am, you, you're always gonna hear it. If you hate hearing about how loving yourself is important in life, you do not wanna follow me because, I mean, that's real, I preach it, man. I preach it day in and day out is what it's just really something I want to spread. I want to spread self-love. And I wanted to share the difference between confidence and cockiness. And I wanted to share the difference between being humble and being overly appreciative, okay? Because if you succeed, don't freaking be afraid to brag about it. You fucking did this. It's your life. You killed it, man. Like, you won. Like, don't ever, ever sit down for anyone. Don't ever shield yourself, shield your goals. You know, just sit down just because, you know, oh, maybe people don't want to hear that. No, no. You only live one time in your life. You're really going to let someone else have the spotlight? Like, no. You deserve the spotlight. Love yourself enough to freaking praise yourself, okay? Because you deserve it. You deserve it and do not, do not wait for other people to praise you. This is another thing that, came, this quote, um, when you put this, your success into the hands of the applause, then you're putting your goals into the hands of the crowd. And you don't want that. You don't want, okay, well, I look good, but I'm going to go on stage and see if I actually do look good. No, I look good. And if the judges like me, then they'll like me. And if not, that's okay because I still like me. That's how you need to think before competing. If you are thinking of getting validated by the judges, a trophy does not validate you. A trophy does not mean that every single girl on stage does not look amazing because anyone who is on stage, you already won. When you get on stage, you're just showcasing it really. And that's just the way that is. I mean, it doesn't validate you at all. So keep your feet on the ground while your heads are in the, cl in the clouds. And don't ever, don't forget it. Don't be overly humble, undermining yourself, making yourself smaller just to make people feel bigger. Don't do that. Don't down yourself, okay? And don't freaking go crazy being like, I'm the best. I'm the best of everything. I'm better than everyone. Like, no, don't do that either. Stay in the middle. Feet on the ground, heads in the clouds, and kill everything you do. Everything. All right? Um, that is my motivation Monday for today. As you can tell, I'm really passionate about it. Um, I just I just really want to spread it. So share this, guys. Share this to your friends. Share this to your family. Share it to everyone. Like, subscribe if you love my Monday motivation. I love doing it. It's really fun. And, you know, if I can motivate one person every Monday, then that's fine with me. I'm totally cool with that. 
So check back in next week. And um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. You're the best.